If you guys are looking to get to max level on blocks to it super easily, make sure to keep watching. So in order to get the script, you're going to want to go to the first link in the description and scroll down until you see this blue get script button. And of course, you're going to want to click on it, but then X out of the page that it opens because it's a pop up. Click once more, but then X out again. But on the third time you guys actually click on the button, it's going to bring you to this page where here you're just going to want to do the task. So we're going to need to install this app. And of course, you guys can remove it right after you finish the install. And once you finish it, you're going to load into a page that looks like this and you can just copy the script. And the next step in order to successfully use the script is to take out an executor like Yvonne. Definitely the best free executor you guys can get. But let me inject and then you guys are just going to want to execute the script that you guys just got from the first link below. And now you got the GUI on the screen and I'm going to be showing you the auto farms. So all we have to do is select what we're going to be using. So we're going to be using our sword. I think that's good. And we're going to have the zero fast attack delay because that's the most OP. And we're actually just going to farm the nearest monsters. OK, so here we have some bandits. And as you can see, we're making quick work of them. We're grouping them all up together and like teleporting them all to each other and then just whacking them. Now, I actually don't recommend doing zero because that can get detected. So what I would use personally is probably like 0.5 just to be safe. And then you guys can go back to farming. Once again, if you don't care about your account, which I'm sure a lot of you guys do, <laughs> you probably want to use something higher of a delay. So like 0.5. So that should be pretty good. And I don't know how many bands is I mean, it looks like there's a lot. Yeah, there we go. We killed quite a few. I think that was like four. And with this, you guys can actually take out bosses as well. If if we kill all the brutes near us. And now we're on to some pirates and the boss. But first, let's get a word from our sponsor. HelloFresh. They have an amazing variety of 40 recipes and over 100 seasonal and convenience items to choose each week. With so much variety, there's options for everyone and every lifestyle. HelloFresh is not just for dinner though. It has you covered for every type of meal, going from snacks, quick lunches, seasonal celebrations, and even festive gatherings. So as you can see, there's, there's a lot. And with HelloFresh, you're getting seasonal ripe ingredients to have quality you can taste. Ingredients also travel from the farm to your house in less than seven days, so you know they're fresh. HelloFresh. Fresh. <laughs> Personally, I think HelloFresh is really useful if you want to have healthy meals without having to spend hours finding recipes, then shopping for ingredients, finally figuring out how to cook them, and then eating. So make sure to check out HelloFresh in the link in the description if that does seem interesting to you. And let's just get right back into the video. So that's what the grouping feature does. It just teleports everybody to each other. So it's pretty cool. And while we're killing this boss, let me actually go over the quest options. So over here, you guys can farm the, your own level that you have. You can also try to fast farm it. You also have double quests, so you guys can do those. And let's actually wait. The boss is almost dead. Three, two, and one. And he's nearly dead. Come on. There we go. And he's dead. So let me turn that off. Don't attack me, bandit. Yeah, look at you. Look at you. Can't do anything. Oh, okay. He like, he exploded. Okay. So let's go and just auto farm our current level. And while we're working on that, I can show you guys some of the mastery options. You guys can also use, just select your dragon fruit distant for its usage and automatically use its skills. So you don't have to sit here and, you know, click X and click Z and whatever. And we also have an item section over here. So if you guys want to see some teleports, it's pretty cool. So here you guys can teleport to all these people, all these bosses. And you can also enable items to get or hop in order to get them. And I think we just finished our quest. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. We're leveling up pretty fast. And before I show you the guys, the other options, let me show you the player options. So let me just turn off my quest farm just for a second. I'm sorry. I know you want to progress, but oh, oh it's, it's not you want you want the beef razor wind. Yeah. Oh, that that did no damage. OK, well. I can escape these guys pretty easily because what I can do is we can walk on water. Oh, they disappeared. Okay. Well, nevertheless, we can still walk on water. We actually don't like fall through or anything like that. So it's pretty useful, especially if you guys just want to get travel around or just show off to your friends. You also have infinite abilities. Pretty cool. This is definitely a really useful feature. And you also have infinite jet bow. I don't know how to pronounce that. 
and the soru option but how about we just do some more auto farming real quick because i think that's, that's that's such a cool option and if you guys have some really overpowered weapons i mean you can wipe these guys out instantly so let me actually show you guys the main section because i did kind of skip over that so over here you guys can remove the anti-cheat it kind of automatically does that typically you also have fps booster which i will show you later on in the video because it does make the game look quite ugly <laughs> Here you can change your settings for the auto farm so you can bypass the anti-TP. You can also remove like these hitting effects once again to save your computer's resources if you need some more FPS. You can also adjust how far away you guys are from like the enemy. So right now we're on 30 but we can turn that up if you if we wanted. Oh we leveled up. And that does affect how well it works, but you know, it's really your choice. And now let me show you the FPS boost. So are you ready? 3, 2, 1. You see how beautiful my game looks? Give it a sec. And now it looks like poop. But, I mean, now you get more FPS, so it might be worth for some people. It might not be worth for some people, you know. It really just depends on your computer specs and if you know you need the more fps and when you are using a gui like this your performance will be less so it might be necessary for some people but if you guys did enjoy make sure to leave a like subscribe down below and let me know what you thought make sure to watch this other video on blocks fruits it's pretty cool infinite devil fruits who doesn't love that anyway watch that and i'll catch you all in the next one bye bye